an enchanted forest this place is it no i wonder why they called it valentine almost perverse seems polar opposite or romantic well i don't know some lady i was speaking to in town told me about a curse a curse now nothing's more romantic than a curse exactly a prince turned into a toad lovers into stone entire country turned into morons Curses everywhere. What's Valentine's curse? Well, I didn't quite understand what the woman was saying, kind of her being a bit of an idiot, but some about a massacre and a last surviving Indian cursing the county. Well, if they massacred people, then they deserve to be cursed. Of course. Good morning. But what was it? W was it just bad luck or bad weather or something else? Something about an eagle or an owl on a gravesite. I didn't really get it. Well, I think it sounds very interesting. When are we hunting another bear? Uh, maybe not for a while. <laughs> it might be for the best. It's enough to turn a good, honest fella to drink. <laughs> Being a bad, dishonest fella, it's gonna send me to drink twice as fast. I just can't cope. Really. <laughs> I can't. What are you mumbling about? Why are we fighting the Philippines, huh? I don't know. Why are you so worked up about it? Forgive me, Tilly. I am getting too old for this gallivant. <laughs> me too. <sighs> Arthur. Dutch, I need you to do me a favor. Nothing too serious. I need you to help Herr Strauss. I've been working hard, Dutch. I know. And I know Strauss's business is not too glamorous, but it pays. Please, son, for me. <sighs> okay. I'll try. But father ain't nothing I know about. Here's a hint. Act like you ain't a selfish, bloodthirsty moron. You mean lie? <sighs> Shut up. You girls actually appear to be working. Of course. We're always working. How's that food coming along, Pearson? Hey, Arthur! What you want? Oh, man, you one sour son of a bitch, ain't you? Only when I see you. <laughs> Only when I see you. <laughs> God, this day is already a pain in my behind. Hey there. Hosea. Ah, Hosea. Are you well, Mr. Morgan? Well, I'm alive, Miss Grimshaw. These girls, Mr. Morgan, they're driving me to despair. Why? No gratitude and no manners. This younger generation, it saddens me. The world is ruined. Sit down, Arthur. That's enough for me. Herr Morgan! Herr Morgan! Mr. Strauss. You busy, my friend? Why? I'll cut you in. Loaning. 
Already? You know how it is. People is happy to borrow off someone like me, but more enthusiastic paying back to someone like you. Of course. Who are they? Hmm, let me see. A Chick Matthews works at Guthrie Farm. He's a hand, I believe. Mr. Robel, the small holder at Painted Sky, runs the operations there, badly. Miss Lily Millet is a ranch maid up at Emerald Ranch. And here was me believing Dutch's bluster about us helping folk. It's legal work, Mr. Morgan. Debtors belong in prison. We are doing them a favor. Ah, I'll make sure they see it in them terms. Put the debts in the deed box and try not to kill them. It's very bad for business. Knock, knock, Mr. Rope. No, przepraszam, co pan robi w moim domu? God damn it. English? Uh, you speak English? Me? Uh, um, Silesia. Yeah, good uh, for you. Silesia. I'm here for money. Do you borrow from a German man? Aha, uh. a German. Uh, um, uh, mein Herr, uh, uh, sprechen das, uh, this, uh, uh, the no, Kaiserreich. I don't yeah? speak German neither. I'm here for money. Money that you borrowed from Leopold Strauss. Aha. Uh -huh. Uh, uh, Leopold Strauss. Uh-huh. Yeah. So it's time to pay. Where is it? Oh, well, no, I have nothing. It's very bad winter. We've all had a bad winter, pal. Ooh. Where is it? Oh, no. No, nie, nie. Now, you remember where you're keeping that silver? Potrzebuję trochę czasu, znajdę ci pieniądze. No, still don't understand you. Where is the money? Gold, dollars. Nie rób tego. I have nothing. No, no, nie. Przestań. Ah, no, 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 no. Please, no. No, I have money, but, but I have this. It's, it's good, it's good, it's valuable, it's, it's Warsaw, yes. I have your things, okay? I have anything in here or out there? Yes. The longer I look, the madder I get. Very valuable. Good? Not good yet. Don't even speak English. somewhere no 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 
Yes, 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 yes. You must have come here with some. I need, I must eat, proszę. Okay, that should about cover things. Yeah. That's it. Matthews. Oh, no, no, not me, sir. Uh, uh, that's the greenhorn over there. Oh, and there he goes. So long, long shark. <laughs> yeah. Damn it. Hey, get back here. You owe us money. Yeah. Last chance to save your hide. Stop.
I got the money, but it's hidden. Untie me, and I'll tell you where it is. You're no place to bargain, boy. Goddamn treasure hunt? You're lucky I ain't taking your teeth as well. Come on, this ain't flat. Blow me down. You got the map. Do the decent thing. <laughs> Aren't you gonna untie me? You'll find it there. Everything. I promise. Let's go, boy. Yeah. Oh. You have any idea of the hole I'm in? Oh, come on! Why has it always got to be such a goddamn performance with you? Now, I told you I'd get you the money next week, and I'll get it. If you didn't make it this week, who's to say you'll make it next? Don't you take that tone with me. I thought you said you loved I me. I do. I do. But what I get paid ain't enough for one person, let alone two. Your money's got to be your problem now. The only problem I got is this bleating going on in my ear. Now lay off it, Lily. God damn it. Lily. Where's our money? What? That loan you took. It's payday. I'm sorry. I don't have it right now. Well, then. I guess we got a big problem, don't we? Cooper! Give him what you've got! I ain't giving him nothing except a lessening damn murder! Son of a bitch! <laughs> Good 
Mr. Morgan. Yes, Miss Grimshaw. Mr. Matthews gave me a message for you. He said when it was convenient to head into Emerald Ranch. He's looking at a few business things there. Okay. <laughs> He'll find something, too. He always does. Will you be well now, Mr. Morgan? I'm always well, Miss Grimshaw. Not for that girl. Much. Of course you do. Goes without saying. No, what am I gonna do? You're gonna suffer. <laughs> and life's gonna go on. That's the truth of it. I, I won't lie to you. Oh, Miss Roberts. I know. Where, where am I gonna go? Stay here with us. <laughs> Folk, they ain't so bad. And, nasty out there on your own. I know. You'll be safe here. <laughs> At least for now. Till you're back on your feet properly. Thank you. Of course. Ben, I've been real worried. What do you want? Don't be like that. Uh, just, a, just a few bucks. And I'm short. Get lost. Well, I'll go try someone with a heart. You do that. How did you get on, Herr Morgan? Fine. Our accounts are up to date. Side sacks, a lot of them. Good, very good. My pleasure. Uh, well, if it's pleasure you're after, there is one other. This farmer preacher fellow I met in Valentine, Mr. Downs. The opinionated little do-gooder? Yeah, I know the one. I certainly know the type. Thank you, Herr Morgan. There's no need to thank me. Like you said, it's pleasure I'm after. He's more slippery than he seems. I've tried being polite. Don't take any nonsense. Nonsense? Me? If he doesn't have the money, beat him. Well, I usually do. I know. I know. Mr. Downs! You, uh, uh, whatever do you want? Mr. Thomas Downs? You owe me money. Uh, oh, no, no, I'm, I'm, I'm... 
Oh, come here, you maggot. Please, sir. I'm... I'll... Really? Threaten me, would you? Oh, please. I have a family, sir. Please. I don't care about your family. Why'd it have to come to this, huh? Believe me, sir. I didn't want this either. You ain't such a do-gooder, are you? If you're running out on debts... I'm... I'm not running anywhere. I'm... I'm... I'm, do I'm doing my best for you. You are a slippery little bastard. But I got you now. Please. Please, show some compassion. Please. Drowse told me you needed a beating. You saying he was right? What will that solve? If I'm here, there's a reason I'm here. If you'd been good, this wouldn't be happening. You borrowed money from my business partner, Herr Strauss. You owe him, you took the money. He wants it back, what's not to understand? <laughs> Where's our money? I don't have it. Sell your place. We already owe more than it's worth. <coughs> then sell your wife, or your family, or something. We ain't your idea of charity. Is that clear? <laughs> What are you looking at? Thomas! I said what you looking at, woman! My husband isn't well! If we could just have more... Like I said, we ain't nobody's idea of charity. Get us the money! Ah, how did you get on? Not so good. He's almost dead. And they seem more or less destitute. You were a fool for lending them the money. Well, people who aren't desperate don't seem so interested in my propositions. Of course. It, if it's convenient, I mean. Sure. If you're out on your adventures and you see any herbs for seasoning, would you mind grabbing them for me? Seasoning? Yes. Don't tell Mr. Pearson. <laughs> okay. <laughs> I'll see what I can do. <laughs> <laughs> 